back to you from the areas neighboring the holy shrines of Imam Hussein and his brother Abu al-Fadl Abbas. Peace and blessings of Allah be upon them with uh, a services unit, but this time we've got a very special story to tell you uh, about the person who directs this very special uh, services unit. The person who directs this, uh, uh, this unit is uh, a famous person, uh, basically a chef who's famous for his, uh, you know, his ideas that, uh, you know, enlightens a lot of uh, women to cook. Now, my dear viewers, stay tuned. We'll go to the person who directs this uh, unit and uh, get to know more about the reasons that pushed him to leave aside his restaurant and his uh, YouTube channel and whatever he was doing in his regular days to come here and to provide the services for uh, the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, peace and blessings of Allah be upon them. So stay tuned, my brothers and sisters. Basically, uh, our brother here, uh, as I said, the person who directs this uh, uh, this this services unit, is very famous uh, for his uh, shawarma. In Iraq, we call it gas. So, we'll come here. The uh, this services unit provides uh, various meals, uh, basically traditional meals. Uh, in the early morning, they cook bagilla uh, bedihin, which is a very famous Iraqi uh, meal. And uh, at the evening, he provides shawarma, uh, in addition to uh, kebab. Well, let's go to uh, our brother and uh, get to ask him more about uh, the reasons that, as I said, the reasons that pushed him to uh, to be here at this uh, unit to provide the services for the pilgrims of Imam Hussein, peace and blessings of Allah. Uh, our brother here, uh, Naeem, who's, uh, who's cooking these various and very delicious meals, uh, is here to distribute uh, uh, thousands of uh, meals on a daily basis. Uh, you see, at this very moment, uh, they just distribute it from the very beginning of this uh, the evening. They distributed more than 15,000 meals to 15,000 different pilgrims uh, on the uh, you know uh, in, in, in various forms and types of food. So let's get to go to uh, Brother Naim and ask him about uh, you know uh, this very reason because it is the most it is the most important thing. Uh, the reasons that pushes a man uh, to do whatever he is doing. So, uh, salamu alaikum. أخ نعيم شنو السبب اللي يدفعك إنه تعيف عملك وتعيف مشاغلك كليتها أو تجي هنا تقدم الخدمات الزائرين؟ والله أول شيء حبا بالحسين واثنين على مسيرة الحسين وتضحيات الإمام الحسين وقدم الفداء للجميع يعني لحد هذه اللحظة وبركاتنا من بركات أهل البيت وشو نقدم نعم وشو نقدم هو قليل بحقهم. ولهذا السبب افنا بيوتنا وافنا شغلنا وافنا حبا بالحسين وحبا بزوار الحسين مثل ما تشوفون دا نقدم بهم واحنا خدام لهم وشكرا لهاي الاذاعه جميله ممنون لك حبيبي. Uh, my brother here just said that uh, for the love of Imam Hussein they, he came here to provide uh, those services for the pilgrims and since uh, the holy imam has you know has given away and sacrificed himself, uh, his family, and his companions in the Holy Land of Karbala. He is here to sacrifice the least to the pilgrims of Imam Hussein. Uh, dear viewers, as you have seen and witnessed the uh, different stories uh, from the holy land of Karbala, from the streets neighboring the holy shrines of Imam Hussein and his brother Abu al-Fadl Abbas, starting from our brother who left everything that he does, his business and uh, his business, his family, uh, and that, you know, the other thing that he does and came here to provide the services for the pilgrims of Imam Hussein uh, and the reasons that he mentioned 
Uh, to the other story of the lambs and their symbolism, you know, receiving the Ahlul Bayt, peace and blessings of Allah be upon them. So that was our tour for tonight. Stay tuned for more tours. Thank you for joining us tonight very much. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.